bring back today, and that is a reflection of our Honorable Mayor Patrick Brown and his city council. I'd like to call up the mayor, Mr. Mayor Patrick Brown, on stage, and all of city council. Please join them. And also, in the spirit of what we are doing today, I'd like to call up all of our imams and wherever you are. Please make your way up onto the stage and join us. All of our multi-faith leaders, people who are here who are faith leaders from other communities, please join us on stage because this is us celebrating something that is so remarkable that, that can only happen in the great city of Grafton. Thank you so much, Patrick.
when you have when you have a victory like that, it shows that we live in a community, we live in a society in Canada where that's not tolerated. That that is not acceptable uh, conduct. And, and I want to thank Mohammed not only for having a, a business in Brampton and for being an active citizen, but for really standing up against hate. And I know we all we all appreciate that. Um, we have a number of Consul Generals who are here tonight, I just want to recognize them. Uh, first of all, we have the Consul General um, Imran Siddiqui, the Consul General uh, from Pakistan, who's been a great friend to the city of Brampton. Consul General. We have uh, representatives from the United Arab Emirates Consulate Office, thank you for being here as well. Malik was here, a member of the National Assembly of Pakistan. So, thank you. We have a large Pakistani community in Brampton, so you should feel at home here. We have uh, members of provincial parliament, Sarah Singh and Garatan Singh. Thank you for joining us. I know our regional chair, Nando Unika, planned to uh, join us as well. And of course, on stage, we have Kathy McDonald, David Green. Bell Bearer Sohi, uh, thank you for, uh, and Anna De Silva from the school board, thank you for being here. Uh, and uh, I would know we, from city council, I should recognize them before, but uh, we have our, our great uh, city council, we've got here tonight, uh, Councillor Jeff Bowman, Councillor Doug Willens, uh, Councillor Paul Vicente, Councillor Juana Santos, Michael Gillespie, Charmaine Williams, Mark Kierit, uh, Singh, uh, I know we have, um, uh, Drew Tree Dillon is intending to uh, join us uh, uh, as well, uh, and Martin Medeiros and Pat Fertini. So we've got uh, almost the entire city council. Uh, and when we discussed having a community IFTAR, they all jumped at the idea of saying, what a beautiful thing to do. And to tell you one of the reasons I really wanted to have a community IFTAR is the more you're involved in the Muslim community, the more you realize how beautiful the community is. Like all faiths, I know that faith communities really give back. They really support charitable causes in the community. Faith communities are really about love. Just last weekend, I was out at the Muslim Welfare Center, and there they were all day trying to collect food uh, for the less fortunate. And that's an event they've been doing for 26 years. Uh, and when you go and see that, it puts a lie to all the stereotypes, all the hate that is out there. And I thought, I see that because I'm involved in the community. How beautiful would it be to showcase the Muslim community for everyone in Brampton to see and have the breaking of the fast, have the iftar outside, at our four corners, in the heart of our downtown, to say to the city of Brampton, Islam, the Muslim faith, is the religion of love, about helping brothers and sisters. How beautiful is it that we're having this tonight in the heart of our downtown, and we break fast it will be outside in our garden square. And one of the great things that this council is doing is we want to celebrate our different cultural communities uh, in the heart of our city. And it's not just going to be the community iftar. We're having the Garba in the fall. We're having a Hallow Hallow uh, celebration for Filipino Independence Day in June. We've got a major event with the Portuguese community coming up and the Italian community. We're celebrating different cultures and backgrounds because that's Brampton. That's who we are. We are a, we are a city that is proud of our ancestry, proud of our different faiths, but proud to be Bramptonians, proud to be Canadians, and today is a demonstration of that. So, on behalf of City Council, I wanted to come and say thank you. Th Shukra, thank you for being part of <laughs> Thank you. Thank you uh, for, for being part of this, and I look forward to uh, breaking fast with everyone uh, outside. Uh, I, would, I, I would note that every year at Ramadan, I, uh, I always fast uh, one day, to show my solidarity and love for the community. I wasn't able to fast today because we had a charity hockey tournament where I was on the ice for nine, nine hours. Uh, but I will fast during Ramadan because I think it's important to show our love for the community. And uh, I know members of council uh, are attending to the same thing. So have a, have a great time uh, this evening. Uh, enjoy the celebration. Uh,
thanks to uh, Urs here as well, who uh, worked her heart out on this event. Uh, thank you, Urs. And to all the sponsors who provide the food, who have helped out with, uh, with this event. Thank you so much on behalf of the City of Brantford.